Sage 1 allows you to create quotes. Once created, these can be printed or emailed direct to your customers. If the quote is accepted, you can then convert it into a sales invoice. To create a quote, hover the mouse over the Sales tab and then select Sales Quotes and Estimates. Then select New Quote. You can choose the customer by either typing to search or selecting them from the drop down list. If it is a new customer, you can select Add a new customer from the list. You can then create a customer record. You then have to enter in a quote date. Once you've entered in the quote date, the expiry date will automatically default to 30 days from the quote date. You can overtype this though if you need to change it. The reference field is optional. Enter something in here if you require. The invoice address will automatically default to the main address on the customer record. If there is no address in the customer record, you will have to manually enter an address here. By default, the delivery address will be the same as the invoice address. If you need to change this, you can do so by selecting Custom and manually entering a different address. If your quote is for a product or service you have already created, then you can add this to the quote by using the search product slash service box to find this. If you want to create a new product or service, then you can use the create product and create service buttons to do so. If your quote is not for something you would regularly sell, you do not have to add a product or a service. You can fill out the description line manually. The mandatory fields are description box, ledger account, quantity, unit price, VAT rate and VAT amount boxes. You have the option to include an item code and a discount. If you are applying a carriage charge, enter the net amount and choose the relevant VAT rate. You can then add notes to the quote. The terms and conditions box will automatically populate with the terms and conditions entered in the quote settings. When you are happy with the quote, you can save it. If you need to save it as a draft, tick the Save as Draft tick box and then click Save. You can also select Save and Send to email the quote directly to your customer, Save and Print to print the quote straight away, or Save and New to create another new quote. Once saved, if your customer then accepts the quote, you can turn it into a sales invoice. To do this, click on the quote in the Sales Quote list, followed by Create Invoice. This will take the information from the quote and convert it into a sales invoice. You have now successfully created a sales quote.